this week has honestly been so crazy. I can't believe it's already Thursday. And I also cannot believe how soon Christmas is. It's really gloomy and cold day in Melbourne, so I don't even know why I'm bothering with um, sunscreen. But I pretty much just put it on every day because I live in fear of sun damage on my face. <laughs> Life recently has felt like it's in overdrive, like everything is due, there's all these content deadlines, there's so many social events and meetings and just, I don't know, there's just so much going on. So this morning I'm trying to slow things down a little bit while the weather is really crap and I can't really shoot content at the moment anyway. I thought I might as well head to a cafe and just try and smash out a couple of hours of computer work. I have heaps of editing to do and also a bunch of emails that I have not responded to so that's the plan for the day. I think I'm going to head to the city because I've also got a couple of errands that I need to run while I'm there. And if you're wondering why I'm committing to so much makeup today, pretty much I have to shoot content this afternoon and we're also going out this evening so I figured I'll just get myself all done for the day. I started using a new foundation recently and I actually really like it. It's called The Luminous Silk by Giorgio Armani. I have it in color 5.25. And yeah, I think it's actually really good. If you've watched my like get ready with me type videos, you'll know that I've been using the NARS Sheer Glow Foundation for like the last five years. But I received this one as a gift and I just tried it to see like how it was. And it's actually really good. So I might continue buying this one from now on, I'm not sure. When I go into the city today, I'm also going to get my eyebrows threaded. So I'm not going to add too much eyebrow pencil because they're going to be like a bit moved around anyway. I really do feel like eyebrows shape a face. And when my eyebrows are bad, which is actually quite often because I find it really hard to get them even because this one is just so different to this one. But when they haven't been shaped at all, I just feel like it's like the most noticeable thing on my face. I don't know, maybe it's just me, but it's like all I can look at when I see photos or content of me is just how bad my eyebrows look. So eyebrow maintenance is very important. Should we put a little bit of lipstick on as well? This is the one that I've been using so much recently and I often get questions on the color. So it's by um, that brand, what is it? Like by Rado, I think that's the name of it. And it's 347 matte and it's called solid ground. I don't know if that's the name or whatever. But the actual lipstick is so cute as well. Like it's such a cute little shape. All done. I'm gonna go and get dressed now. But before I do that, before we continue on with this video, I just want to say a huge thank you to eBay for sponsoring this portion of the video. As you guys probably already know, I have been working with them now for a couple of months. So I quickly want to share with you guys some information regarding Black Friday, which is fast approaching. So this year, eBay is bringing the best Black Friday deals to the table. There will be exclusive member only savings, as well as lots of new and high quality Australian retailers to shop. I didn't actually know this, but eBay has over 40,000 Australian retailers that you can shop for. From. Retailers such as Maya, The Good Guys, Big W are all available to shop at eBay Australia. So I just purchased these vans from eBay and I was actually able to unlock free shipping using my eBay Plus membership. eBay Plus also offers free returns and massive savings on hundreds of the retailers. Also, these vans will be on sale for Black Friday at eBay Australia. Anyways, I thought it'd be fun to show you guys how I would style these vans a few different ways. So. Let's get into it. I personally feel like a pair of black and white old school pro vans pretty much go with everything, but here are three outfits that I would wear them with anyways. For the first outfit, I've just gone with this salt and pepper gray polo long sleeve top. I've got on a leather blazer slash jacket these charcoal gray trousers, which I've honestly been living in the last couple of weeks. They're just so comfortable. Just a really simple black hobo bag. And of course, I've just got on my new Vans. All right, here is outfit number two. I wanted to include a little bit of color in this outfit. 
as you can see. So we've just gone with a white singlet, my green leather jacket, my favorite little black bag, my favorite high-waisted white jeans. These ones sort of have like a little bit of a flare, if you can kind of tell there, and the Vans. All right, here is outfit number three. As I'm sure you guys know, I'm definitely more of a pants kind of gal, but I do still really enjoy wearing skirts and dresses on the occasion. So I wanted to show you how I would style Vans with a dress. So I've kept the white singlet the same. I've then added this black maxi knitted style dress, a really simple little gray cardigan, crossbody bag, and my Vans. Anyways, that is all. Let's get back to this video. Cheer pudding recently and it's literally so good and so easy to make. All you need to do is add two tablespoons of chia seeds and half a cup of like whatever milk you like. You can also do yogurt. I use almond milk but anything really works. I found the key is to let it sit like this for like maybe two minutes and then mix it through really well and make sure there's no clumps and that way when you eat it in the morning it's really good and for breakfast i usually just top it with some honey and some berries and banana and that kind of stuff but you can obviously just do whatever fruit you've got Ta -da. all right we are heading out again this is the fit for the evening. We had different plans for tonight, but they kind of got canceled because of the weather. So instead I'm just heading out for dinner, going to meet Nick now. Let's go. Peanut butter and something ganache. 